So, Keith, the two negative reactions happened almost immediately. While this does increase the concern that is out there about this vaccine, health experts say the good far outweighs the bad. Tonight, the FDA investigating two allergic reactions to Pfizer's coronavirus vaccine in Alaska. Within 10 minutes of getting the shot, the healthcare workers saw bad side effects. One felt lightheaded with a scratchy throat. He was back to normal within an hour. But the other, a middle aged woman with no history of allergies, experienced shortness of breath, an elevated heart rate, and a rash. She was hospitalized for two nights. So, could you have a bad reaction to the COVID 19 vaccine? We asked Dr. John Green, the chief of infectious diseases at Moffitt. And if they're going to vaccinate 300 million people, you could have 300 to 3,000 allergic reactions. While the allergic reaction could be deadly, Dr. Green says at each vaccination site, there's a life saving kit with medicine to open up airways. If you have a history of allergic reactions, you'll need to talk to your doctor first. If you get the flu shot and have no serious worries or concerns, then you should have no serious concerns with this. This doctor doesn't uh, just talk no the evidence. talk. I got it myself at about 10 30, and everything went well. I didn't uh, feel any different, and uh, the needle was just like the flu shot to me. Tonight, everyone that has had a negative reaction to this vaccine has received standard treatment for allergic reactions and recovered. And there were two similar cases out of Britain. Right now, researchers are trying to figure out what component of the vaccine is causing the negative reactions here. And Dr. Green says, heads up, we could possibly see more negative reactions when people take the second dose of this vaccine. Live in the Tampa News Center, Masa Saidi, 8 on your side.